down to Dan Alexander, the leading scorer. Mitch Clark, the second leading so, scorer, and he knocks that one down from three to open things up uh, for the Hawks. That time it's out of Dove's reach, and it lands with uh, Lewis Thomas. Another three, a couple of early threes for the Hawks. Just skip up Ben Persa. Steps around, had a little bit of space. Clark, a bit of a heat check. Second one in a row, and it's down. Three from three from downtown for the Hawks combined. Clark advances quickly to Leary. He would normally let that one fly, but this time he kicks out to Clark again. And again it's Clark. Four from four. And they'll defend that on-ball screen. Oh, that's uh, a loose ball there. Turnage did well to uh, cover some ground and get close to a block there, but Clark's good enough to score. A good vision, good, good kick-ahead pass. Excellent vision there from Michaels. Clark will give himself space. Strong to the basket. Got to see if the Wolves can get this margin. Michaels has sort of slipped on the floor there. Yeah. He was always going to give that up, and Persa did well to score. Clark wanted no part of Matty Mo. The Hawks uh, just made life extremely difficult for CJ. Oh, a cheeky little step back from uh, Mitch Clark there. He continues his good shooting. This is the starting five unit for the Hawks that open the game. Mitch Clark finds a seam to the basket. He's able to rattle that one home. With the nine points, but it's uh, still CJ Turnage is relatively quiet night offensively with nine points. I feel like Mitch Clark's almost taking it slightly personal, that matchup on Brian Michaels. He wants to rip and go. The home crowd starting to get behind their team. Ben Purser kicks it out to Clark. This is one he'll need to make for his wow. side, and he does. Wow. He had the side to earlier, and this one's um, gone down. Cruz.